As you see behind us is the uh, USS Little Rock. Uh, she's a light cruiser. Uh, the reason why they call it a light cruiser is because her tonnage. She, had, she weighed 12,000 tons, and also she had smaller size naval guns. She had six inch guns, vice, like a heavy cruiser, had eight inch guns. But she is the last Cleveland class cruiser that's in existence today. The first ship, whose name was given to the whole series, was laid down in summer 1940. Her displacement was much higher than the standard for light cruisers at the time. For this reason, the Cleveland class ships are sometimes called heavy light cruisers. The Americans realized that their key opponents were across seas and oceans. Consequently, to disrupt enemy communications, you had to cross either the Pacific or the Atlantic Ocean. So they needed a big ship with a large displacement, high self-sustainability, and powerful armament. Key specifications of the Cleveland-class cruisers. Total displacement up to 14,300 tons. Length 610 feet 3 inches. Speed 65 feet 7 inches. Draft 24 feet 7 inches. Armament, primary armament. 12 Mark 16 guns in four turrets. Caliber 6 inch. Dual purpose artillery. 12 Mark 12 guns. Caliber 5 inch. Anti-aircraft artillery. Different ships of the series were equipped with up to 28 Bofors and up to 20 Orlick and Auto Cannons. Armor. Armor belt and conning tower, up to 5 inches. Deck, 2 inches. Turrets, up to 6.5 inches. Air group, 4 float planes. Maximum speed, 32.5 knots. Cruising range, 11,000 nautical miles. <laughs> 